Hey everyone, this is uh, video number four of the series. Uh, and if you remember, we'll do a quick review. In the video number one, we set up the Control Logics uh, processor, input card, output card, and the Ethernet card. And uh, that's everything that we're using in the chassis. Uh, in video number two, we built tags. We built base tags and alias tags, and all of those were a bool. You can see them right over here. Those were bools. That's one, uh, one single digit of information. Uh, in video number three, we created a program to see this run. And if you remember, um, when we set up the start and the stop, these are tied to real world devices and the green light and the red light are tied to real world devices. Uh, so this video is going to be downloading and monitoring those, uh, this program. So the first thing we need to do, go up to communications, who active, we need to select our processor and we put our processor in slot zero Remember, our uh, IP address uh, was 10.109.1.1. We go through the black plane. Uh, we are connecting to the processor in slot zero, and then we just simply download. And uh, usually this is pretty quick. It doesn't take a long time. All right, so now you can see right up here, we are in run mode. The controller is okay. The IO is okay. Now, uh, our start is a normally open push button uh, and we tied it to an examine on. Uh, and then our stop is a normally closed push button uh, and it is tied to uh, a normally a normally closed push button and is controlling the latch. All right, so there we go. There's our normally closed push button uh, is the stop. It is an examine on, right? So it's examining if it is on. And currently it is on. If I press it, it, you see it go off. Our start button is an examine on because we want to see when it is pressed. Uh, again, we're going through the normally closed push button uh, of the stop. That's going to hold on this latch. The latch will then go around the start after it's pressed and seal this in. You can currently see this is uh, the latch here is an examine on. So when it comes on, it will turn on the green light. And this is an examine off. So it's examining to see if this bit is on or off. And currently the latch bit is off. So it's going to be turning on the red light, which you can see it's highlighted and the red light is on. So now when I press the start button and you can see the latch came on uh, this latch came on that latch came on and the green light right here came on the red light went off I'm gonna release the start button you can see that this went away we are being held on through the latch through the input of the normally closed stop button holding the latch on and the latch is holding on the green light. And uh, the examine off went off because latch came on, so therefore the red light went off. So we're going to um, go to our tags now and I'm going to monitor the tags. I'm going to go ahead and shut everything off. 
Then I'm going to turn on the stop. You can see that our stop is a 1. Remember, 1 means on, 0 means off. Our start is off, our red light is on, our green light and our latch are both off. And if we look at the program, our start is off, our stop is on, the latch is off, uh, therefore the examine uh, off is on, and our red light is on. And we can see that in our tags. We go to tag, controller tags, monitor tags. Now I'm going to press the start button. You'll see this change to a 1. You will then see the latch turn to a 1. You will see the green light turn to a 1. And you will see the red light turn to a 0. So here goes the start push button. I just released the start push button so it changed back to a zero. Our green light is on, our latch is on, and our stop is on. And if we go back to the program, you see that right there. Now, when I press the stop, we will lose the latch, which means we will lose this latch here, the examine on, and the green light. We will get the examine off, and we will end up getting the red light. And we'll watch that in our tags. So we go to controller tags, monitor tags, and I'm going to press the stop button. This will change to a zero. The red light will change to a one. The latch will change to a zero and the green light will change to a zero. And that is how you download and monitor uh, in a uh, Studio 5000 Control Logics uh, program. Uh, the next video, uh, I believe we're going to go into functions. We're going to show you some different types of functions and how they're working. Uh, we will introduce you to a dent, which is a double integer. That's two words of information. Uh, and we'll go through a, each video from here on out. We'll probably cover one single function um, until we get past some of the uh, some of the basic ones: timers and counters, uh, comparison instructions, um, move functions. Uh, several of them. We're going to make several of these videos. So uh, be sure and come back for video number five. Thanks, guys.